Good morning, everybody. We are here day three of the cruise. Uh, another beautiful day at sea. Um, we got up pretty late today because, well, you know, we were up pretty late last night. There's Raf. Nick's still in the room. He's, uh, he's sleeping still. Uh, he got back even later than us, but uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, we're heading to breakfast right now. I think we're gonna go to uh, the Windjammer. Oh, there we go. We're gonna grab it and get in the elevator right now. You know, this is what I've been dealing with the whole cruise. Every 10 minutes, if not less. Okay. You gotta make sure your hair is perfect, okay? Everyone, every guy knows the struggle. Yeah. All right, guys, we're going to get some food here. Oh, entrance is this way over here. Never mind, we're being pointed that way, so we're gonna go that way to get some food. We're walking into the wind jammer today. Waiting in line for the wind jammer right here. Uh, this is actually probably the busiest I've seen it, but it's, we're getting close to pre pandemic cruises, so. Uh, it's getting busier as we uh, go along, so busier than the last time it was on in December, that's for sure. Uh, but yeah, we're, we're moving, we're moving slowly. Uh, but I just wanted to show you outside, I don't know if you can see it or not. Not really because it's blocked off, but if you look down, there's Central Park right there. And then you got the water sports port over here as well. And I'll show you inside when we're in uh, Windjammer as well. As we're back here, we're in the buffet. We grabbed our food. A little bit of a lineup to get a little bit disorganized, uh, but um, for the most part, we, we got our food, which is great. Um, I got my food right here. Uh, I got some, uh, what do we get? We got pancakes, French toast, sausage, bacon, hash browns, beef hash, and some uh, scrambled eggs. We're gonna be enjoying that, and then uh, I'm not sure what we have planned for today. We'll figure it out, and I'll bring you with me. This beef hash, is absolutely incredible. Um, I'm enjoying my breakfast. We're, we're, we're working through it, but um, beautiful. We're just leaving breakfast, but they're putting lunch out and I am really, really tempted. Look at these desserts. All right, guys. And what's amazing is how hard these crew work. These crew are working day and night. Wanna oh, say hi? Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> they are working so hard. They're constantly going, making sure everything is done properly and to the top of best service possible. Um, just, it's incredible. Uh, but yeah, they're setting up for breakfast on that side I, or for lunch. And I have some footage there for you. Uh, Raph went to go fill up his water bottle, but he's back. Um, but yeah, the crew guys, just 10 out of 10, absolutely amazing. Like you can see, they're getting the pasta ready here. They have some pasta there. The chefs in the back there are cooking, making that. There we go, they're gonna say hi, see? <laughs> so they're, oh, we got some dancing. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Welcome to Windjammer. Take care. Thank you. Enjoy your day. Thank you. You too. Guys, cruising is just the life. Can we tell them why? Everyone's so happy to be here. It's just incredible. <laughs> Uh, we're at the back of the ship right now. You can see right over there. We are doing rock climbing, me and Nick. Right over there. Uh, Raph's in the gym again. Uh, but we are doing rock climbing today. Uh, we're gonna get our shoes on and uh, we'll start doing that. Obviously, we're gonna film it. Uh, but yeah, bring you along with us. Jump neck.
done? I couldn't find my next like hold, <laughs> so I just jumped. Would you like to go again? Come on. We just finished the rock climbing. Now we are at the very back of the ship here. You can see the uh, trail that the ship is leaving with its uh, propellers. Absolutely incredible view back here. Um, just, again, another benefit of being at sea for the day, you can see nothing but water around you. I'm actually gonna try to show you. I don't know if we can get there or not. I don't know where it went. Never mind. There was a sailboat in the water. We don't know where it came from, but it was in the water and it was just sailing. No land to be seen, so people are just enjoying the day, I guess. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's the uh, the ship I was talking about. I'll try to zoom in a little bit more there. Like I said, it's just sitting there. No uh, land nearby from what I can see. I think we are close to the Dominican Republic, but uh, yeah, I just wanted to show you how cool that was. Do you know where we are? We are back in Central Park. Yes, I do look a little bit sweaty right now. That's because we're outside enjoying the sun. Um, it's me and Nick here. Nick just went to get the some outside. drinks. outside. There he is. We're uh, enjoying our lunch here. We got Central Park again. We got two sandwiches. We got a jerk pork uh, sandwich. I got a turkey wrap. Nick got the royal, and I checked I checked to make sure what it was called. The royal Kummelwick um, sandwich. Again, staple on Royal Caribbean, great. And then of course, what, it wouldn't be a, a lunch without cookies. So we got our cookies. Um, yeah, and then uh, we're just enjoying lunch. And then we're, I don't know what we're gonna do. We'll, we'll figure it out, probably zip line. Zip yeah, line. I'll show you guys. Nick says zip line. All right, so we're gonna do zip line. We'll show you guys there later. Hey guys, we are here on the top deck. Um, well, close to the top deck. That's the top deck. Um, we are here. We're probably gonna do zip line right now, but I did want to show you a roundup here. This is what they call the sports court. Um, right across from me, you got the zip line right in the middle, and you got the soccer, basketball court over there. Um, on this side, you got the two full riders, one there, one there. Um, and then you've got the mini golf right behind me over here like we were doing yesterday. We'll probably do that again today. But I did want to point out one thing on this ship. If you can see behind me, that, uh, I think that one right there, right with the, uh, like the climbing things in there, that's the ultimate family suite. And that suite can cost upwards of $80,000 a week. Absolutely insane. It has its own slide inside of the cabin. Um, but yeah, it's something that like I'll probably never ever do, but just to imagine paying $80,000 for one week just to be in that room, kind of crazy. You get your own butler, you get everything, top-notch service, of course, but $80,000, is that uh, something you think you can afford? I can, but uh, maybe one day, we'll see. But yeah, just wanted to show you guys around. Uh, that's the top deck, we're gonna do the zip lining now. Uh, I think you've seen someone come across, but pretty cool. Stay tuned, got a full day ahead of us still. We'll see you soon. We're right here. We're gonna do the zipline. I'm gonna go do it right now. So the next time you see me, I'll be doing it. Nick will be filming me, um, and we'll do that. But yeah, I'm gonna get that done. I'll see you guys in a bit. So Nick, give us the 411 on your experience. It was, it was great. It was mm -hmm. a great, uh, great, great, great experience. Great experience. Out of ten, what are you, what are you doing? Uh, I'm gonna give it a, a nine out of ten. Nine out of a ten. A little bit slower than 10. I'd like, but it was great, great views. Uh, you look down, you see the whole uh, boardwalk. Mm -hmm. Absolutely incredible experience. I think everyone should try it when they're on Symphony of the Seas. Symphony of the Seas, um, yeah. Yeah. Great, yeah. great time. Yep. Overall, great. Thank Overall, you. Thank great. you for your time, Nick. Thank you're you. Welcome. You're welcome. And even though they did this on a cruise ship, look at this. We got dodgeball going on. This is crazy. And I swear this was not planned. This was not something that I had planned to do or planned to go right now, but we are at El Loco Fresh over here. There we go. We're all having a great time um, here and we are digging in on more food, of course. I got my uh, taco that I made over here. Uh, and then I got a quesadilla. You can make custom bowls, custom everything. Basically Chipotle on steroids, and you don't have to pay extra for guac. That's a big thing, right, Nick? Big, huge. Yeah, free guac. 
who, who's complaining? Um, just, just absolutely incredible. You can see everyone's having a great time. The guys coming in the picture. There's Raf. Uh, I don't know what he's doing. Um, <laughs> but he, he got some food too. He loaded up on the guac as well. And he's having coffee. Why? Me and Nick have stopped asking questions at this point. But, uh, yeah. Uh, food again, right? Why not? We are here on the pool deck once again. And we are just going in the pool. We're going to get in there. This is a beach pool, as you can see. Um, it it kind of rises up here. It's pretty cool. But we'll be in there just having a good time, you know. Last couple of hours of sunlight. So we're going to be doing that for a bit. And then we will uh, figure out what's going on. Cool. So I just wanted to give an update. I've been sitting in the room for about 15 minutes now. And Rafa's had to redo his hair probably 10 times. That's not true. As he turns on the blow dryer again. Guys, we are here in the dining room for day three of the cruise, night three of the cruise, and we, uh, we ordered our food. I'm a little bit hungry, not crazy, but I think I went crazy on ordering the food, as usual. Uh, I did order pretty much half the menu, but uh, it'll all get in, and I'll show you all of it. But uh, just so you guys know, I'm gonna, I'll show you what, I'm, what I ordered. So I ordered for my appetizers the shrimp caviche, seafood cake, and of course the escargot. For our entrees, I ordered the braised beef short rib and a grilled pork chop. And then for dessert, because you can't forget dessert, I ordered the Mississippi mud pie and the lemon curd. So we got lots of food coming. I'm going to show all of it to you. And uh, yeah, we'll I'll show you. All right, guys, good evening. Um, I know you guys probably can't hear me. Let me, let me go inside for one second. Uh, we're in our room. Nick and Raph just went down to the silent disco. I'll show you that guys a little bit later, but uh, I wanted to show you guys the uh, Hyro uh, water show in the Aqua Theater at the very back of the ship on the boardwalk. We were supposed to go see it, then reservations got canceled and mixed up, and we had a conflict, so we couldn't do it, um, unfortunately. But, but we can see it from our room, so I'll just show you it over here before I head downstairs. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll turn the camera around so you guys can see it. I know you guys have the abyss in the way, but you can kind of get an idea of what's going on. All right, guys, before I went to bed tonight, because it is uh, almost one, um, I did want to say good night. Thanks for taking a look at today's vlogs. Um, this was day three. Tomorrow is day four. And we are making our first port of call, and that is St. Martin. Um, and we will be getting off, and we're going to be going to Maho Beach. If you guys uh, see me before, videos from before, um, on my Instagram, you will see that, uh, and that's uh, Nick underscore underscore travels on Instagram, uh, but you will see some pictures, but uh, I'm going to Maho Beach again I'm gonna show these guys here because they've never actually been uh, So I'll show them that and we'll uh, go see some planes landing uh, But yeah, so I'll take you along with me tomorrow, but thanks for watching today guys. Take care. Good night